with our friends at ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresca. Here's your need to know weather. Headed back to school today, we've got a front that stalled out just off the coast there. Temperature readings today warming only into the upper 90s, 10 degrees cooler compared to yesterday's record breaking heat of 109. Looking for temperatures along the coastline in the low 90s. Katie, today, a high of 100. We do have some heat advisories across the area, south and west of Houston, excessive heat warnings through 10 o'clock this evening. The rain chances going up. The proximity of that front could be a focus point for some scattered showers and thunderstorms. It looks like those showers and storms may move in late this afternoon into the evening hours, especially for our coastal communities east of I-45. Some of the areas a little bit more favorable for that rain this afternoon. And then late tonight, a little wave of moisture moves in north of I-10 could move through the Houston area. So it could start off your Tuesday morning with a few wet roads. Otherwise, mostly dry through most of the day on Tuesday until we get into the afternoon. Could get another round of a few brief heavy downpours south and west of the Houston area. So a couple opportunities this week to get some rain. The highest rainfall totals today will be centered right along the coastline. And then by Tuesday, there could be some rain popping up along the I-10 corridor. Quick mention of Tropical Storm Adalia. Again, this is not going to be a Texas storm. This is a storm system that will have some rapid intensification over the next 24 to 36 hours. Now projected to be a Category 3, a major hurricane as it moves onshore along the Gulf Coast of Florida sometime um, early Wednesday morning between Panama City and Tampa Bay. This is going to be a storm system again that we will continue to monitor. All right, this is holiday weekend. We've got Lab Labor Day weekend coming up. Chances for rain increasing a bit Saturday and Sunday. And we're going to keep the temperature readings this week 100 degrees or below. So a noticeably cooler week ahead again with those rain chances built in. All right, my friends, that's a look at your forecast on this Monday. Thanks for watching.